Hey guys, welcome to another video. Uh, today we're going to be talking about volume and how to edit it on your Thinkorswim app. So volume is this graph right here. It shows the number of shares that were traded traded during a certain time time frame. So right now we're on a one year one day graph. So it's this number right here, like uh, 54 million, roughly 54 million. That means that about 54 million trade, it's not trades, shares were traded on this date, um, 8-1-19, and the date is at, here at the top. So how do you change this chart? In order to do that, you have to go to the settings up here, and then you can go to equities, because Apple is an equity, all stocks are equities, and then you can do show volume subgraph. So this shows you the volume. So if you uncheck this box and click apply, this graph right here should disappear. So let's click apply, and now it's gone. If you want to show the volume, then you just apply that. So you go back to equities, click show volume subgraph, apply, okay, and it's back. There's a few other things you can do with volume. So for example, if we go back to chart settings, uh, and then we go to Let's go to, I think it was price axis, no, general, uh, yeah, general. We can also overlap volume. So overlapping volume is going to move this, let me move this here, it's going to move this chart here into the uh, price graph up here. So let's, let me show you what I mean. Overlap volume, apply. See, now it's all together in one chart. If you want to undo that, just undo that uh, check mark. So go back to settings, we're in general, uncheck overlap volume, apply, OK, and now it's separate like that. You can also change the appearance, like the color of these bars if you want, and you can also change, um, change how much of the screen it takes up. Uh, first let me show you the colors. So for the colors, just go to the settings, uh, this time we have to go to, I think it's appearance, yeah, appearance, and then here we have this this section over here, volume bars. So present color is yellow, you can click here to change the color, make it uh, blue, click apply, it'll show down there. You can ch uh, choose more, there's more options, there's all these different colors you can choose, here's a green. And you can change it like that. So let's, uh, for me, I like yellow. Let me change it back to yellow. Apply, OK. And then if you want to uh, make this part bigger, you can actually do that by just, if you look at my mouse, I'm going to uh, move it up. And now it changed to these two arrows. So I'm just going to left click here, left click, and then I'm going to drag up. And then now I'm going to let go. So see, you can change the way that the volume looks. And then if you want to bring it back down, you just move your mouse back up till it changes. It changed, so I'm left clicking. Now I'm going to drag down. So you can change it like that. All right, that's pretty much all I have to say on volume, and I'll see you guys at the next video.